And you all have bingo cards in front of you. And there are letters from A to E. Okay? Use your pencil to circle. And whoever gets their bingo first, which is either going to be, I should show you in case you don't know how to play bingo, down like this, all of them, so you would circle all of these, or across, or diagonally, this way, or this way, okay? This way, or this way, but just one group, right? Is anybody unclear on that? Carla? <laughs> okay, no? Okay, dear. So, um, I'm going to show you the letters as well as say them. And whoever gets the bingo first will be the person to hold the door open today uh, when the kids are going out for lunch. Okay? Yes, you may. Okay. So the first letter is B, lowercase. You may have more than one also. You might want to check. You may have more than one. Okay. The next one is lowercase d. The next one is uppercase B. The next one is uppercase C. No bingos yet? Alright. The next one is uppercase A. The next one is Lowercase e. All right. Bingo. Oh no. Okay. Well, she did say bingo first, but that was you were so so close. Man. So let's see. Where's your bingo? All right. Let's just check. Yes, A and B and I know what this heading. So you got them all. Good job. All right. You can keep those little ones. Okay, so today we're going to be doing this LO, which is the students will be able to identify specific uppercase letters, A, B, C, D, and E, when compared to the lowercase letters, which are the same as A, B, C, D, and E. Okay? So. First, I want you all to notice that each one of our letters of the alphabet that we're all very familiar with, with have two names. We have upper and lowercase. So you see the upper ones and the lowercase. Each one is written in a different way. Who could tell me what you would find in uppercase letter? Where would you find it at? How about Carla? A name. A name, yes. Because we always start our name with an uppercase letter. Right? Here is E, you see? Somebody else can tell me the difference between the upper and the lowercase letters. Kesley. Kesley, thank you. You use them in different parts, like you said, sometimes with names, and lowercase letters are usually in the middle of words or words that aren't important. Yes, that is true. There is another difference. Maybe Gordon can tell me also. Between upper and lower? Yes. The size. The size. So the Uppercase are larger or the lowercase are larger? Uppercase are the larger. uppercase are larger, that's right. And if I had a book, which I don't, oh, if I had a book. Any <laughs> book? Yeah. What would you notice about this book? Does it have uppercase mm -hmm. and lowercase? Yes. It has the whole title is in. Uppercase, right? Health and wealth. Okay? And of course, we would notice in the book that if we found an actual paragraph, the beginning of the paragraph would have an uppercase. I know this is a really little print. See? The word the has an uppercase, right? Let me see. Mm -hmm. Okay, so proud of you. right now is I'm going to have you guys use your handy dandy whiteboards and I am going to say a letter 
And I'm going to have you write the uppercase. Okay? So, please write uppercase B. And don't show it yet until I tell you. Okay, show it to me. Good job. Okay, you ready to All right, show me uppercase D. Okay, I'm sorry, show it to me now. Very good. Good job. Okay, erase. Okay, right uppercase C. Okay, show it to me. Very good. Okay. And finally, right uppercase A. Okay, show it to me. Very good. All right. Now I want everyone to write the uppercase letter of their first name. Okay, show it to me. Wow, we have three K's and one G. That's awesome. Okay, I'm very impressed. Okay, now. I am going to show you a card, and all I want you to say is uppercase or lowercase, and I want you to do it in choral form. So that means everybody's going to say uppercase. Lowercase. I don't even want you to tell me what letter it is. Okay? That way it makes it easier. Okay, are you ready? Good job. 
Okay. Yes. Gordon? D. Yes. E or A. <laughs> A. Good job. have that memorized. I'm very sorry. Okay, you guys are so awesome. I have one little ice ticket for you today. And I want to know, does anybody have any questions about uppercase and lowercase with these letters? No? You all understand? This is your little exit ticket. On your way to lunch, when you're done, you will line up at the door. So you have a group of two letters, just like you had on your um, independent study. And you're going to circle the one which is Uppercase, that's what we're looking for today. Uppercase. So And you're gonna hand them to me before you line up, okay? That way I can make sure that they are perfect because I know they will be eighty percent accurate. I know you'll do it. Yes, ma'am, that's still the only one. Even if you don't finish first, you are still the one that holds the door. Good job, Gordon. You did perfect. Good job. Sleep? Like one sleep, but with a K. Oh, okay. Good job. <laughs> Good job. And Kim? Also excellent. And I know that Carla did 100%. You are all so perfect. And I hope you have a nice lunch. I know she's going to hold the door open. Thank you.